The brand Boohoo is little known to the general public, yet it is the world's number one online fast fashion company. In 2019, the turnover of this English brand approached 1 billion euros. The Boohoo Group has its own line and also other brands, including Pretty Little Thing. On its site, Boohoo sells this dress for 9 euros. At this price, you would think that it comes from an Asian workshop. However, this garment was made in Europe, in the United Kingdom. Leicester, a working class city of 300,000 inhabitants in the center of the country. Until the 1970s, Leicester was the capital of English pantyhose and exported its textile products all over the world. Large factories employed thousands of workers. The textile industry has since returned to Leicester. However, with working conditions are like those of the third world. Workshops are a hidden world where cameras are not welcome. <laughs> Once people see with camera, there will be 100 phone calls in Leicester in within 15 minutes now. The man who has allowed us to film is called Saeed Kilji. Originally from Pakistan, he is one of the city's most successful entrepreneurs. This is a factory where we are making garments. How many people are working here? We have 92 people. 92 people working. And this is one of the biggest factories in Leicester. Yeah. All fast fashion coming from Leicester. And Leicester has great uh, manufacturing capacity that nobody has in UK. Not even in UK, nobody has in whole Europe. Leicester can deliver any garments within unbelievable delivery time. Leicester is master of fashion garments. Manufacturers return to Leicester for its location in central England, convenient to save time. Time is very much on Saeed Kilji's mind. He develops his own label while supplying English fast fashion brands. If you want business in UK, you need to be very quick in delivery. We will see this finished garment in one hour time. They send us a picture that this is something is very nice. Can you develop something quickly, similar? We are very close to customer. Once the garment is ready, we deliver same day. So we are quickest. Say for example, this development, they want to make it in China. If they send pictures to Chinese supplier, even if they make garment same day, they need to post it. The post will take for four to five days. Then they will receive the, okay, they will respond next day. If there are any changes to be made, then they have to resubmit the garment. That will take another 10 days. So they already lost two weeks, just for sampling. I will write P production sample. This is ready to go. I'll just post your sample and send your receipt. So once you receive Monday morning, please approve before 12 o'clock. Process is done now. Sample is gone now. We will get approval. They will receive sample at this special delivery. So once it's approved, we will go for production. So the whole process from order to delivery, it's uh, 12 days. 
This is the unique point of Leicester, of our industry here, that we can do quick, fast service, quick delivery. The fabric is available here all the time. So if the customer needs it very urgently, we can provide them within two weeks' time. But you we cannot finish. lose one day? We cannot lose one hour. Forget one day. The, this is our. We are calculating hours and minutes here, not days. Clothing designed, produced and delivered in two weeks, twice as fast as Zara, at unbeatable prices. But this efficiency comes at a high price. The workshop district has become a lawless zone in the heart of England, a shady system of subcontracting. We have few number of very powerful brands or retailers, buyers at the top, that place orders to a very large number of smaller manufacturers that chase smaller orders every day. Obviously, engenders competition and pushes prices down. For manufacturers, it's always important to take any order they can get, even if they don't have the capacity to fulfill the order. And that is part of the problem. They have to subcontract it. And often they subcontract it to second or third tier factories where working conditions are of a much lower standard than they might be in the first tier uh, manufacturer. There is no shortage of job offers in these sweatshops. Embroiderer, cutter or dressmaker. Tanya is a journalist. Equipped with a hidden camera, she will go undercover into the workshops of Leicester. I'm looking for a job. Do you know if somebody here is looking for somebody? I learned very quickly, so I'm looking for a little job. I don't know, packaging, sewing. Or... How many do you? In Great Britain? Yeah. Only for some uh, weeks. So do you know somebody who is looking for some workers? You know, it's time. One week, yeah? It's good work, no problem. Okay. Okay. But this one you is cash, no trust to money. You know any problem? And you no problem, no. Come. Okay. The windows are covered up. It's the middle of winter and there's no heating. The boss offers a trial period, unpaid. You can just work two weeks is try. It's very learning ladies. After two weeks, three pounds. Three pounds yeah. per hour. Yeah. Three pounds per hour. This is illegal. In the UK, it's not even half the minimum wage. How much hours should I do? Like, no problem. 10, 10 or 14. Ah, like. even 14? Yeah, no problem. It's open. So I can... Uh, uh, happy? No problem. At what time should I come here every morning? Yeah. Okay. 6 o'clock, please. 8 o'clock till 6 o'clock. Yeah. Okay. I will try. This one, it's not an easy one. Only not step by step. No, 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 no step. But I have two weeks to... For any job post, a brief demonstration of the sewing machine. And what is this? A skirt. Skirt, OK. Only having arrived a few hours ago, Tanya, a novice seamstress, is making skirts, free of charge. These skirts will be sold online by one of the biggest fast fashion brands. Pretty little things. Pretty little things. Pretty Little Thing is one of the brands of the Boohoo Group. 
The skirts that Tanya manufactures are sold for 15 euros. It's barely 1 p.m. when suddenly work stops. Workers paid by the hour are sent home without compensation. Fast fashion has engendered a rise in informality, a rise in precarity. Workers essentially work on a system of informal zero-hour contracts, so they never have a contract. So see you tomorrow? Yeah, see you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye, Tanya. Bye. The Leicester workshops have a bad reputation. Many brands are now refusing to do production there, but not the Boohoo Group and its brand Pretty Little Thing. <laughs> 